right. Boys, there's the shadow people. Finally caught him on video. We just killed him. Hunter is gone. But now, there's a new threat. As you can see, that is our squad mate. The reboot van is out of power. So, while the reboot van charges up, we gotta, <laughs> we gotta get, um, we gotta, we gotta go get this dub. Okay. Dub's on its way. It's a very somber cutscene. It's unimportant. Next person on the list of players left in the game. I'm committing to this bit, by the way. Next person is right here. This this person's a bird. They can fly. And of course, their name is um I'm I'm debating which Pokemon legendary bird I want to name it. Well, once we'll get there, we'll pick, I'll pick one. I'll pick one. It's looking like he goes down the same path. Or a similar... Maybe we should go down this way. Because, like, it is closer that way. Let me look at the map. Yeah, it's... We're going that way. Because there's two... We're, we're gonna... We're, I'm gonna teach you all about lizards. Okay. Lizards do be lizards, though. And when I eat them, yummy, 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 in my tummy, I, I gain power, strength. I become a more powerful being with each lizard that I ingest into me. I'm the freaking lizard king. So this one's this one's a long walk, and if Dave keeps messing up, it's gonna be a longer one. So, pretty simple. This one, we're just gonna zip zap zoop all the way down to the point where here here's the lizard zone, the lizard shrine. To to say hi to the lizard person. Basically, somewhere on here, there's gonna be a lizard, and I'm gonna shoot him sh and shoot him good. Okay. He's gonna. He's not gonna be a lizard when I'm done with him, if you know what I'm saying. Cause he's gonna be dead. But that's not what we're talking about right now. Right now, I'm just talking about. You know, the lizard's probably not here, considering I'm in New Game Plus. Uh, sorry, I was considering it as the start of a new playthrough and the lizards don't spawn. Right? That's that's what we're in. Okay, we're just gonna jump off. Because we can heal right here. Just go up. Go. Whoop. Full health. Right, I'm at full health. I can't, I'm not looking at my health bar. Am I? We'll go back. I think these they might just be the save. Nope, full health. Sorry, I couldn't see. I have my switch dock right in front of it, so <laughs> didn't see. Okay, back to the quest. The quest at hand. There's gonna be a little patch of light here, and if I'm correct, Mon. No, oh, I guess I don't need the little patch of light because that's still kind of showing me where I need to go. And I can see that pillar. So basically, we go right here. And then it's like, the spooky. It's pretty spooky. Kind of spookers, if I do say so myself. Uh, so we're just going to want to swim. It's another long swimming section. Oh, that's good to know. Um, so we're just keeping down this long swimming section. Now, I know what you're saying. What what happens in this long swimming section? Simply put, it's how we enter the arena. Because in this arena, we're going to have to fight a bird. 
we're gonna have to fight Pidgeotto. Pidgeotto, this is a guy. it's not really Pidgeotto. We're gonna have to fight. I mean, it kind of looks like Zapdos. It also kind of looks like Ho Oh. You know what? N n r put your opinion in the comment section below. What does this bird look like? Bird should be coming in. Like, now, right there. That. Right there. It's got long wings, long tail, small head. It kinda looks like a dragon, too. But I think it's a bird. It's definitely a bird, judging by its feet. It's a bird. I don't know. No. Let's just go with Timmy. It's little Timmy. Okay. It's little Timmy. That's what we're naming it. I was gonna name it a Pokemon bird. But that how how original is that? This this series is all about being hundred percent original. So it's Timmy. Why are the ripples? So weird. They're all originating. Originating. Not in like a straight line like they would. They're originating from various circles. Which is not how swimming would look. Still good water, but like kinda weird ripples. Um, so for this one, it's pretty simple. Pretty sure his underbelly's pretty soft, yep. So we just shoot him, and we don't get hit. I got hit. Getting hit was not the plan. I was focusing on switching my hand. Feels like a hat. And unfortunately, the health. For ye old health bar. But, it doesn't change something. It doesn't change anything. Yeah, he's going in, and then we're just gonna lead the shot. So we're gonna go up here. Oh, I guess he's holding up straight. Did I get him? Yep. I am an archer in this game. Okay, we'll really switch to the sword this time. He's gonna come in and attempt to do... <laughs> A little swing, but not this time. I've learned the music's picking up because the grass that's going on is very good. soft. Upside down is a tech here you can let go. Really, just sit here. I think you just take it and stay in here. What are you? 
doing? Um, anyways, should just be as easy as that. If you, you do the thing, you do it right. It works. There you go. You should be able to about three shot this guy. On your average playthrough. Ugh. Now we gotta get out of here. And quick. Before the fire nation comes. My friend, Amayori, says that this is scary because he played Subnautica. He doesn't know what's down there. Which we didn't know what was down there, to be quite honest. It's like the tentacles got us. But we'll be smarter next time. Thank you for watching.